Hello my YouTube friends, welcome to Fun Club. Today we are going to learn about direct and direct speech in present tense. So there are some rules that we have to follow to understand direct and indirect speech. Now let's have a look now on the sentence. For example, we say Alex said, now remember we are today going to learn about present tense in direct and indirect speech. So we need to choose a sentence with the present tense. Ali said, I work in an office inverted commas over remember there is a rule that in direct speech the first speaker always contains i and the second speaker always contains you now we have only one speaker which is alex so for alex we use I work in an office and this is the sentence of present tense. Now we have to convert it into an indirect speech. Let's convert. Alex said that now see I is the subject for Alex and we know that the gender of Alex is a boy. So we'll use he for Alex. He now there is a rule. If there is a sentence of present tense, then we'll change this present tense into past tense and indirect speech. He worked in an office. Full stop. That's it. Now, let's look at another example of this speech with two speakers. Alex said to... Alina. Okay, now you see there are two speakers. First speaker is Alex and the second speaker is Alina. Now let's see what Alex says to Alina. You, our focus is on present tense so we have to make another sentence but from present tense. You help me. Inverted commas over. Now we know this is the sentence of present tense but According to this rule, first speaker always contain I, second speaker always contain you. Now, Alex is the first speaker and Alina is a second speaker. Now, you guess that second speaker is Alina and we know that you subject is always for the second speaker. Here we have the second speaker, Alina. So, this you is of course for Alina. Got my point? Now, now let's change this sentence into indirect speech. Alex. Now we know that Alex is talking to Elena. So we'll replace this said to into told. Alex told Elena that. Now you guess. I told you that you is always for the second speaker. And here with the second speaker is Elena. And Elena's gender is female. And of course for female we use she. She and now let's change this into past tense. Help will be converted into helped. Alex told Alina that she helped him. Let's take a look now on another example. Kef said to Victor. Now here we are starting with subject I. Okay, so we have in our next example now. Kev said to Victor, I do shopping with you. Now let's change it into an indirect speech. Kev told Victor that. Now you see, this is the first speaker. This is the second speaker. And I, and here you check this rule. First speaker always contain I. So we know that I is for Kef and Kef is a girl. That she did shopping with, with, you is for second speaker, with him. That's it. Thank you so much. I hope you must have understood present tense and direct and indirect speech. Take care. Bye-bye. And please subscribe my channel.